On 25th of December last year, I saw one drawing old Dutch uh, uh, man. Then I just jumped and picked him up. And everybody welcomed my action in the name of refugees. Then I was like, why? I saved somebody from different religion, from different language, from different culture. But I just helped him. The word refugee should only be used in legal procedures, but not in the social environment, because this discriminates us. I just want to disagree that we shouldn't use the word refugee. I'm a Palestinian refugee. I was born a refugee. And there's a story behind my journey and the journey of over 50 million people. It's a result of circumstances that we passed through. Any person, a politician, an organization, a presidential nominee that wants to go on media and stigmatize refugees should be held accountable today. Look back into the history. There were refugee crises among Europeans just a few decades ago. So let's not have a short-term memory when it comes to humanity and to this subject. As I was growing up, there was something about just simply being Kurdish. You're stateless, you don't belong anywhere. And I felt isolated because I was just simply not Swedish enough, which is absolutely ridiculous because I see myself more Swedish. There are people just like me who are extremely grateful for everything they've been given. And I wish that the kind of help that I hope to give people and children today in Sweden, that that kind of help was around when I was younger. My first encounter with soldiers was at the age of four. My mom and I were already arrested and at that point they could have they could have taken me. But he did not have enough space in his car, which is why I got left. So it's not something you, you kind of plan for, it just happens. Only this year we lost around three thousand people in the Mediterranean Sea. Most of them is women with children. Why? We need to facilitate all this legal way to ask asylum and to get protection and your messages to the UN summit will be heard loud and clear, I know that. Please encourage your, your friends and others to put their profiles on the I'm a migrant, I'm a refugee platform because that is the way we get your stories out and that is how we have you here on the program today.